Paul West here testing the uh, chili powder uh, cell. This was created on 4512, and I wanted to go over the ingredients. Again, it's the chili powder. water and then I added uh, on the uh, magnesium I used silicone grease dielectric grease and over the top of the grease I ground down uh, some quartz and rolled the uh, grease or put the, the quartz dust on the grease. Put it into the cell, into the copper, and then put the chili powder around it. And then on top of it, I added this dry out which it was intended to collect moisture from the air and keep the cell dry. So the bottom of it I had tape. I removed it and this cell is pretty much dry. I mean it's been dry since it was created. No moisture So let's test it. Also, just a quick deal on the light that I'm using. This is from a landscape solar light. And I just removed the inside and the LED was in there and this is a rechargeable battery this light has a on and off switch these two connectors here are from the battery these two connect to the solar panel and when the solar panel is running, this light goes out. So what I've done is taken these as if this all west power cell was a battery and connect, connected directly to those. been running on the, the light since it was on 4 5 12 got 1.19 So this is set on 50.
So like 35. It's pretty constant. Thanks for watching. One more thing I was thinking of is having these two leads here charging the uh, battery when it's when the light's not on. And uh, maybe you can in your comments uh, reference how we could do that. But this is a cheap way to get a jewel thief plus the switch and plus a chargeable battery so uh, but the, the way it works is these will actually turn off the light won't come on when these are charging so, so anyway that's it from all west thanks for watching